They call me the problem, but you could call me the can man, cause anybody can get it. Africans, Americans, Dominicans, Mexicans, anybody can get it. Boxingvoice.com, Victor here live with the winner of ESPN2 Friday Night Fights, Mundo Beltran. Ray, I want to say congratulations. Um, when you heard the decision, were you at all surprised with the decision? No surprise because I knew I win. But surprise because, I mean, for real, I almost stopped believing in boxing, man. You go to a backyard and normally they rob you. And I was like, fuck, you know, like, I was worried. Worried about, like, man, they might not even give me a decision. This guy's ranked, they might don't let it go that easy, you know what I mean? But I mean, I'm glad, I mean, God is great, and, and, and those people here is real. People appreciate real boxing, you know. We need these kind of people to bring the real champions. And, and I thank him, you know, God bless him. Now, the, in the, I believe it was in the third round. You guys traded some massive shots to end the round, and, and it looked like both of you were hurt. Can you tell us about that situation that occurred there where you simultaneously hit each other in that to end the round? Yeah, you know what? Uh, I believe in the ropes. When I got him in the ropes, I know I got him hurt because I gave him body shots. But then he knew to how to adapt, and I couldn't fucking get him to get his double body shots. But um, I got him hurt. I didn't get hurt. You know, I didn't. He got me good, but I didn't get hurt. You know what I mean? And... But it was a good, good fight, man. Now, in the middle rounds, it seemed like he was adapting to you, throwing the jab more, and he wasn't letting you get him on the road. So what did you do after he established his jab, kept it in the middle of the ring, to get him back on the ropes? And do you think that was the difference in the fight? I think uh, I let him take the control. That was my mistake. And I, and I let him to, to get comfortable. That's why, you know what I mean? But soon I start like doing my job, my job, and be first, be first, be first. You know, and that's when things start working back on my side, on my way. Now, you've come a long way. I mean, we've seen you on 24-7, you know, being Manny Pacquiao's chief sparring partner. And now you got a victory in the main event. They were saying this guy was tabbed to get DeMarco Broner. Do you think you throw your name in the hat to get a Broner or a DeMarco fight? Fight anybody, bro. Fight anybody. I'm the kind of partner. I'm just like him. Like I say, like I told him, man, you and me, we are real fighters. We fight anybody. We may, we may, we are made out of a, the real deal, you know. We're not fucking build paper champions. I fight him, my Marco, Broner, anybody. I don't care. Just tell me where it is, and I go. I fight him. Now I just wanted to ask you this. I mean, you've been a guy that's been on the wrong end of some tough decisions. How did you continue to fight on to get up for boxing when it seemed like boxing wasn't treating you right? Man, you know what? I was like almost losing my hope, losing my hope. But the only thing, I never start praying us and praying God, man. And I know God is great, and, and, and uh, my family, I love my kids, and, and that's, that's what I do. What I do, I mean, for my kids, my family is the only one kept me fighting stronger and giving something, at least buying my house, something. What's next for Raimundo Beltran? Man, I'll be training, I'll be there, I'll be there waiting. Only guys knows, like I told you, time ago, always, uh, uh, what's next for you? I mean, I don't know. Promoters got the control and they do whatever they want to do. But only guys knows, man. You can go against God's will. So only pray, we forget what it got for me. But something good got to happen for after this. Now, just look into that camera and tell your fans, man, whatever you want to say now. I mean, it's a great victory for you. Hopefully there's more things to come for Raimundo Beltran. What I want to say, man. Thank you for keeping an eye on me and supporting me. Always fight for the people, for my family, my friends, and my fans. You know, I always, always fight hard and put my heart in it. I'm, a, I try to bring a, a good show. You know what I mean? And and just don't keep supporting me. And, and I'll be there. I'll be there. And, and, and God bless you. And thank you for support. There you have it, boxing fans. Ramundo Beltran, fresh off his victory over Hank Lundy, ESPN Friday Night Fights. You never give me a fair shake. HBO needs to fire you. You don't know shit about boxing. You ain't shit.